Right, um, hello there, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube and of the Hunter Call of the Wild community. Hello, it is JP, and welcome back to Hunter Call of the Wild. Yes, um, you've probably seen the thumbnail and title, so I'm not going to beat around the bush. It is um, me getting my 10th albino lion. Yes, I know, 10. Um, I have been hunting lions consistently throughout the year. And then I kind of got addicted to getting albinos, so I just kept grinding, got one, got two, got three, got four, got five, then I got six, seven, and eight, and, and then I got nine, and then for a month I didn't get anything, uh, like for lions at all, not even diamonds, not even rares, so I kind of stopped grinding lions, but then this month, the month of December, I started to grind them again, and number ten appeared out of absolutely nowhere. Um, you can see I'm going to run to the lake. She's going to teleport behind the tree. She doesn't want to be spotted, but it doesn't matter. There she is. Boom. Number 10 for albino lions. And it's a female, which is perfect. Now, some people are probably going to say, well, it's female. Well, don't you really want a male? Of course. Like, a male albino, they look cool. But the female worked better for my lodge. Because if I got a male, I would have to move things around and probably take something out to put that in and I'm kind of a, a weirdo when it comes to having things like symmetrical and like looking good so the female worked because like I had a I had a breadwinner of all rare lions but I could easily just make it into all albino so the female worked better in my opinion and I'm kind of happy I got one um, because like I said, I don't really want to keep moving my main lodge around. Like, I've got a lot of good things in right there that I don't want to have to take out. But if push comes to shove, I'm going to have to do it. But I'm constantly staring at her. I'm telling Ozzy, look, look, sit, look and look at it. It's albino. Um, but yes, I'm going to try. I don't think I've done this before, but I'm going to try and heart shot her. Uh, here we go. Ooh, uh, oh, he's done it. Oh, yes, the controller drift has not ruined his day like it did with a 9 legendary jackal which I could still cry about but yes she's down with a heart shot and I'm kinda relieved because not gonna lie my lodge is kinda full of lions there's about four breadwinners <laughs> one's a full albino with an albino buffalo one's full albino with lions one's full dark brown and one's full blonde uh, I kind of need to stop grinding lions. I, I have too many now. Even in my spare lodges, uh, it's full of lions. So now with this 10th albino lion, I think it now puts the, uh, not the nail in the coffin, but brings the story to a close for a little bit for lions. I can finally just leave them be and hunt other species. But there she is in all her glory. I'm, oh yes. And she is, believe it or not, my biggest female. None of my albino lionesses have been uh, a bronze. But I think we should go to the trophy lodge and see where I've placed her. And there we are. Damn. Oh, hello, doors. And welcome to, to my awful lodge. I know it's terrible. There's going to be a trophy lodge tour, I believe, the first day of 2024. Um, so, get... I know, get excited for that. I guess it's you can only see bits of it. It's terrible, but as you can see, I've got four males here at the at like entrance to the main room. As I said, the full albino breadwinner at the very, very back, and then down here in this room is where the female resides in this group right here. I believe she is the last one there, which is the the one you can see, the one at the very front. There she is. Um, and it just worked better. This multi mount was a dark brown, blonde, and an albino. But I had the, you know, the, the the lions to make it all albino. So I just went with that, and it looks kind of cool. And plus, albino lions are probably one of my favourite rares in the game. I'm not going to lie. I do have ten of them. I think I think it must be a sign that I do like them. But let me know down in the comments. Should I replace this uh, Cape Buffalo with another albino, maybe a leucistic or a diamond brown? I kind of do want a diamond brown. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know what is your favourite species to grind to get multiple rares of. Uh, I kind of want to know. Mine's clearly lions at this point. But uh, everyone, take care. Stay safe. Happy hunting in 2024, people. And I'll see you there.